I'd, I'd say that I'd never imagined this would ever happen where my picture would be on display, you know, in a migration museum here. But I did imagine it was happen because I always knew from the age of five years old I was going to be a professional footballer. Born in Lewisham Hospital, Sanderson grew up in Catford, where her goal-scoring talents were spotted at the age of nine by Arsenal scouts. So I lived in Lewisham up until I was 21, but I actually got scouted for Arsenal playing in Catford, and I went for a trial for Arsenal, and, I, and the rest is history. So whenever I go into schools and speak to kids and stuff, you know, I've gone into schools in the local area, I say to them, you know, I got scouted by Arsenal just next to your school, and their mouths drop on the floor. There was a couple of times on Wikipedia, they actually had me as down as living somewhere else. But I was really like, no, this needs to be changed. I'm from Lewisham, you know, and I'm always proud to be from Lewisham. She fell in love with football at an early age and persuaded her footballer father, Jeff, who played for Crystal Palace and Southend United, to sign her up to a local boys' side. I played at Arsenal for 12 years, and then I moved to play for Chelsea for one year. I had a two-year contract, and then I got asked to go and play in America. It was one of five players that was picked to go and play in America, so honestly it was the best decision I ever made. I thought I was a good player before I moved to America. I'd won everything at Arsenal, we won the Champions League. I'd already played in one World Cup at that point, and I was doing really well, but the Americans, like, they're so fast, they're so strong, you know, and, they, and it's like you never get a moment to breathe. And I think it really allowed me to get fitter as a person as well, because I always had the football brain, but when I first moved to America, I was one of the least fit players on the team. My dad used to work different hours to take me to football. My mum was working different hours. And now I realise the massive commitment that they made to me, because if that was my weekend, I'd want to relax. I'd more of an appreciation now for how much they did for me. Sanderson broke into the Arsenal first team in the 2003 to 2004 season and went on to write her name into the North London club's history books, scoring 48 goals as Arsenal won the quadruple in the 2006 to 2007 season. 2015 was my favourite tournament when we won the bronze medal. Going into that tournament, I'd played in every minute of every game. I scored the only header I've ever scored in my career, but everyone thinks I'm really good in the air. Um, against Wales, we qualified for the World Cup, we won 4-0. I came on against Germany and the ball was thrown into me and I just turned the defender and the defender pulled me down. We won the penalty. I won the penalty. We beat Germany 1-0 and won the bronze medal. The fact that I got the opportunity to come off my country and win the, um, to win the penalty for us to win the bronze medal and, you know, it's a moment that I'll never forget in my career. Sanderson went on to play and score goals for a number of leading clubs in England, Europe and the US, including Chelsea, Juventus and Orlando Pride. She won 50 caps for England, scoring 15 times for the national side. I thought being a professional footballer was my dream job, but the fact that I get to wake up and talk about football, the fact that I get to talk about football now is just a dream come true. And I'm really grateful that I love the game and it's a dream job, it really is.